I know I have been hitting a ton on the defensive line, the offensive line, and the wide receiver, mainly during my player prospect profiles. And those are no doubt the big three areas of need for the Chicago Bears. But today I'm going to talk about someone who is underlying in that fourth need position, in my opinion, which is the defensive back position and someone they can take in the third or fourth round. And in my opinion, you can never have too much secondary. Today, I am going to be going over J.L. Skinner, defensive back from Boise State. Before I get more into J.L. Skinner, please make sure to hit the like button on this video. Put your thoughts in the comments section below. And if you like this video and want to see more, please hit the subscribe button. Tomorrow's video will have the prize you can win. Thank you for us celebrating 4,000 subscribers. All you need to do is hit the subscribe button and you're automatically in. So let's get to the main topic of today's video, J.L. Skinner. Skinner is a defensive back for Boise State, standing at 6'4", 220 pounds, and mainly plays safety. He is a 22-year-old senior from San Diego, California. His 2022 stats are pretty darn impressive for a defensive back. He had 62 total tackles. Tackles, 36 of those being solo, 26 assists with four interceptions and four pass deflections. Sounds like a true ball hawk to me. According to his scouting profile, thanks to NFLDraftBuzz.com, he has 85.2 overall grade. He's the number 17 ranked defensive back in this upcoming NFL draft. He is a 40 time of 4.55, QBR when targeted of 55.4, tackling 74 out of 100, run defense 65 out of 100, covered 78 out of 100, zone 74 out of 100, and man and press coverage 74 out of 100. Bears need another defensive back and Eddie Jackson won't be around forever so why not start bringing in 2.0. According to scouts he is very aware and I totally believe that considering the fact that he has four interceptions and four pass deflections. His also low 55.4 QBR rating is something that really stands out. One thing I haven't hit on yet is his hard hitting ability. This dude puts guys on the ground and he hits with absolute force in all his body strength. He also is really good at breaking up passes but also fumbling the ball. Could be a Charles Tillman 2.0 with a peanut punch, but no one will ever be peanut Tillman. We all know that. And finally, he is one mean dude on the field. You see him trash talking every now and then. You see him getting in the heads of other opponents. And I think that's something that the Chicago Bears need. I'm all about classy football, but you do need your one bad guy on the defense. Put your thoughts in the comment section below of what you think the Chicago Bears should do and if JL Skinner is someone they should go after. But with that, thank you very much for joining this episode of Just Another Year Chicago. My name is Nick Rohde, and we'll see you guys next time.